It was an amazing opportunity for East Kootenai students to be inspired by one of the best known scientists and activists of our time. Dr. Jane Goodall spent a few days in the Cranbrook area delivering her message, A Reason for Hope to School Children, Adults and Educators. Kimberly Davidson has more. A face-to-face -face meeting with Dr. Jane Goodall is a dream come true for Libby Wilmot. Because I was a big fan of her and when I grew, grew up I wanted to be like her and she wanted to meet me too. The eight-year-old gained Goodall's attention by declining presents on her last birthday, instead raising money to sponsor a chimpanzee through the Jane Goodall Foundation. It's once a child becomes empowered and you start listening, then they start taking off. It's that spirit of empowerment to create change that Dr. Goodall is bringing to this group of students and educators in Cranbrook through her Reason for Hope presentation. Yes, we will. Yes, we will. Yes, we will. Thank you. I think it was very interesting and inspiring. Going back to our mother and child. While relaying stories of her time spent with chimpanzees in Africa, she's also sending out a call to action for each child to work to improve the world they live in through her Roots and Shoots program. They must choose one project to help animals. Of course, we're animals, but I mean animal animals. Uh, one project to help people and one project to help the environment. Tens of thousands of young people in more than 120 countries already participate in Roots and Shoots projects, like Libby, inspired by Dr. Jane Goodall, to make a difference. Kimberly Davidson, CTV News, Cranbrook.